Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. Now this is my first spring haul of the year, even though it's trying to snow outside at the moment. I've seen the crocuses poking their heads up and the daffodils are getting ready to burst into life. So I think it's okay to start thinking about spring fashion. As you can see, there's quite a few pastels in there, just one black top I'm gonna to show you. And I am focusing mainly on tops, tops that can be worn with jeans around the house. Just a couple of blazers I'm gonna show you. Everything's from and other stories, which is a first for me. I've never done a haul from there before and I'm not really familiar with their sizing. So some of the things I'm gonna show you are actually the wrong size, but I'll show you those as I go along. Let me show you the first thing. I'm gonna start with this top that I've got on, which is a really pretty feminine wool knit. It's actually wool and alpaca blend. It's got this lovely honeycomb detailing across the top and it's got these very subtle bubble sleeves. I've just paired it with my blue jeans from Zara. I do love pink and blue denim together, but it would look lovely with black denim as well. This is a size medium and this fits me absolutely fine, this one. Um, but it's not cheap, it's £85, but it's a lovely, comfortable, cosy, feminine looking knit. And I think it will transition lovely into the spring. I'm going to stick with pink and show you this blouse next. It's cotton, it was £65 and this is one of the ones that I could have downsized with. I've got it in a size 40, I'm not quite sure what that is in UK sizing or US sizing actually. But it is a little bit big for me. This pattern carries on all the way around to the back and it does up with a little button at the top. It's got a high ruffle neckline and it also has some lovely detailing around the sleeves. I've just put this with some blue jeans again and I've tucked this in. You could easily wear this loose but because it's A-line it can pile on the pounds. This is more of a trend-led piece but if you wanted to feel a little bit more feminine and a little bit smarter while you're at home I thought this top was lovely to wear around the house with jeans. I've got a few wrap tops I'm going to show you, but I wanted to show you this one first. I've got this in a size medium. This one fits me fine. This is another alpaca and wool blend mix, and it's beautifully soft, very comfortable. And what I like about this one is the length. It's a little bit longer than lots of standard wrap style cardigans. It sits lower on the body, and I find that a little bit more flattering. I've put this with some black jeans. I love black and cream together. The belt is actually quite long, so you could tie that in a few different places. You could tie it at the middle at the front, to the side like I have. You can even tie it at the back. It does also come in pink, which is very beautiful, but I thought I'd stick with a more classic cream colour. So I've got another wrap style top to show you. This is a much dressier top. It's a little bit more expensive. It's £85. This one fits me nicely, and it's pretty much the same shape as the cream one I just showed you. It's got these really beautiful big balloon sleeves. There's velvet on the sleeves and it's fully lined inside as well, but the sleeves are quite sheer. I put it with some black skinny jeans, but this would look lovely with a really nice pair of black trousers or more fitted pair of black trousers, but it's a great length. It just sits on my hips. So it's a little bit more flattering and the V-neck line is really flattering too. I haven't had to pin it at the front, but it is a little bit iffy. To be on the safe side, I probably will pin it. This would be lovely for Valentine's Day if you are doing something nice, even if you are at home. It's a really beautiful, flattering shape I top. I love the colour of this blazer when I saw it. It does come as part of a suit. You can get trousers as well, but I just didn't think that I'd get the chance to wear both together. So I just went for the blazer. I got it in a size 42, but it is too big for me. I really should have got possibly two sizes down. And also it arrived damaged as well. It came in a cardboard box, I think left in a puddle of water. And it's got a big stain mark all around there and around the sleeve as well. I just put this very simply with a white t-shirt and blue jeans and a beige croc bag. It doesn't look too big really, especially with all the oversized blazers around, but it does feel too big. It does up with a single button at the front. It's fully lined. It does have a belt as well, which you could tie around the waist. Belts generally don't suit me, so I tend to tie them at the back. And it costs £99. Lemon is a favourite colour of mine, and I love it warm with white in the spring. This is one that I picked up in the wrong size. I got this in a size large, and it is a little bit too big for me. It's got a very traditional style collar with a nice V neckline. And then to switch it up, it's got this frill cuff. I'm not sure if I'm a fan of the frill cuff or not. I think it's difficult to tell because it is a little bit too big for me. This is another one that I've just put with blue jeans for now, just to show you what it looks like on. It has a nice length to it and a nice thick rib at the bottom. And I do think this would be nice to wear around the house. 
this one I could have got in a smaller size. I got it in a size 40, which is a little bit big to me, but I just thought it was a really beautiful looking blouse. It's got puff sleeves. I really love puff sleeves. A really nice neckline, which you could do up or just leave a couple of buttons undone. It's got lovely detailing down the front and also down the back as well. It's been finished really nicely at the bottom, so you could actually wear this tucked in or wear it loose too. I've tried it two ways. I've worn it loose with some blue jeans and I've also tried it tucked in with some black jeans too. It's another very feminine looking top more of a trend piece with the puff sleeves and the frill cuffs but I think it's nice to throw in a trend every now and again and I think in the spring and the summer this will look great I just wanted to show you this very quickly I love the color of this and it's got a really unusual shape as well it's not double breasted it does up with a single button but it crosses over just slightly unfortunately this one's a little bit too big for me and I've just very simply put this with black jeans and a white t-shirt it is a nice spring blazer and a lovely colour to wear into the spring, but the size is wrong for me. I'd love to know if you've shopped at another stories too, and if you've had any sizing problems with them. Do let me know in the comments box below. Bye for now.